What is the primary law governing data protection in Sweden? A. Swedish Data Protection Act B. General Data Protection Regulation GDPR C. Swedish Surveillance Law D. Electronic Communications Act Correct answer. B. General Data Protection Regulation GDPR Who is responsible for enforcing GDPR in Sweden? A. The Swedish Parliament B. The Swedish Authority for Privacy Protection IMY C. The European Data Protection Board D. The National IT and Telecom Agency. Correct answer. B. The Swedish Authority for Privacy Protection, IMY. Under the GDPR, what is not a legitimate basis for processing personal data? A. Consent of the data subject B. Legal obligation C. Vital interests of the data subject D. The data subject's hair color. Correct answer. D. The data subject's hair color. What is required for the lawful processing of personal data under Swedish law? A. A processing fee B. Explicit consent or another legal basis C. Annual reporting to the EU D. Membership in the European Economic Area. Correct answer. B. Explicit consent or another legal basis. Which right is not explicitly provided to data subjects by the GDPR? A. Right to data portability B. Right to be forgotten C. Right to internet access D. Right to object to data processing. Correct answer. C right to internet access what must be appointed in certain processing situations according to gdpr a data protection officer dpo b a swedish legal representative c gdpr compliance manager d head of it security correct answer a data protection officer dpo in sweden what legislative act regulates the use of cookies and similar technologies a. The Swedish Cookie Act B. GDPR C. The Swedish Data Protection Act D. The Electronic Communications Act. Correct answer. D. The Electronic Communications Act. What is not a principle of the GDPR? A. Transparency B. Accuracy C. Profitability D. Storage limitation. Correct answer. C. Profitability. What action should a data controller in Sweden take in the event of a personal data breach? A. Notify the Swedish Authority for Privacy Protection B. Apologize to the data subject C. Wait for the data subjects to file a complaint D. Publish a press release. Correct answer. A. Notify the Swedish Authority for Privacy Protection. How are international transfers of personal data from Sweden to countries outside the EU regulated? A. Through Swedish export laws B. By the Swedish Data Protection Act only C according to the adequacy decisions or other safeguards under GDPRD, no regulation is required. Correct answer. C. According to the adequacy decisions or other safeguards under GDPR. Which sector-specific legislation in Sweden might require a permit for its operation? A. The Camera Surveillance Act B. The GDPR C. The Swedish Cookie Law D. The Marketing Act. Correct answer. A. The Camera Surveillance Act. Under what circumstances can electronic direct marketing be sent without consent in Sweden? A. Always, as no consent is required B. Only if there is a pre-existing customer relationship C. When the recipient is a minor D. If the marketing is considered non-intrusive. Correct answer. B. Only if there is a pre-existing customer relationship. What does the Swedish Whistleblowing Act protect? A. Employee data in whistleblowing systems B. Employers from false accusations C. Whistleblowers from external threats D. Customer feedback and complaints. Correct answer. A. Employee data in whistleblowing systems. For processing special categories of data, what might Swedish data controllers need? A. Authorization from the IMYB. A public opinion poll C. Approval from the EU Commission D. A statement of public interest. Correct answer. A. Authorization from the IMY. What does the Swedish Data Protection Act supplement? A. GDPR provisions B. Swedish Penal Code C. The work of the IMYD. The Swedish Constitution. Correct answer. A. GDPR provisions. In Sweden, how are data subject rights under GDPR enforced? A. Through the European Court of Human Rights B. By the Swedish Authority for Privacy Protection C automatically by AI systems D, solely by data controllers. Correct answer. B, by the Swedish Authority for Privacy Protection. What is not an objective of the GDPR as applied in Sweden? A, protecting natural persons regarding personal data processing B, 
free movement of personal data within the EUC, establishing a European cloud infrastructure D, enhancing transparency and data processing. Correct answer. C. Establishing a European cloud infrastructure.